anak Malaysia Sayang anak Malaysia Sayang anak Malaysia Sayang anak Malaysia Mana bantu 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 di mana? Mana? Di mana? What is happening? Malaysia, a multi-ethnic country, which has already achieved independence for more than 60 years, we are supposed to live together peacefully by respecting each other. We are supposed to stay together like a family. However, it doesn't. The racism issues are still happening around us, even though we are all well educated. And these situations is getting worse. We were like learned nothing from the 13th May 1969 tragedy. It seems like Malaysians doesn't improve so much for so many decades. Why is that? A lot of Malaysians nowadays lack of the willingness to understand and tolerate others. Malaysians even lack of rational thinking. For example, the lawyer fighting case that happened in 2015, it is actually only a case about a group of thieves who tried to steal the phones from the store but they failed and get caught by the police. However, it became a racism case eventually. Like, how? The thieves who get caught, they went back to the Laoyat Mall and took revenge. After that, there were a lot of fake news spreading through the social media. Even got some people, they make use of this topic to incite the racial hatred. <coughs> Maybe this guy has failed his sejarah. As a Malaysian, we all know that the independence of these countries was achieved because of the hard work from all the races. The leaders like Tunku Abdul Rahman, Tun Tan Cheng Lok, Tun Sam Banten, other leaders from the different races. They were working together to achieve the independence for this country. For now, the main reason of why the race relations in Malaysia is getting worse is not only because of these kinds of fighting case actually. They are just a small part of Malaysians. The main reason is us. Yes, all the Malaysians. In the era of social media, we are able to see a lot of news, posts, and status that is shared on Facebook, Twitter, or any kind of platform. A lot of us only think and judge about the case from only one perspective. We didn't verify the truthiness of a case before we share a post or comment. Like a case has nothing relates with the racism issues, but we make it. Yes, honestly, it is really hard for us to stop some people to spread the fake news and some hate comments. What we can do is, we need to calm down, think, what are the consequences after you take the action? Don't take revenge by scolding back, don't criticize some races just because some of them did something wrong, it doesn't help anything, it just makes things become worse. We need to think from different perspectives. Don't take your ethnocentrism into your actions. 
Malaysians is like a group of people which has different color. But a lot of us are still only willing to stick with our own color and avoid from others. It is very dangerous because you will never understand and get know each other's cultures. The gap will become wider. And our unity may be broken easily because of a small thing. Think of it. No one likes to fight. How come there's a rainbow if all the colors are separated? Why not we accept each other's and learn other cultures, understand them? We can actually add different colors into our life, which can make us and our country become more beautiful. Think before you act. And let's stop hating and start loving. Thanks for your watching.